Morehead State University continues to be one of the top military-friendly institutions in the country. Um, our current and former military uh, students are able to have barriers removed um, as a result of the services that we provide for them. The university in the past five years, I would say, has put a strong commitment on um, providing services and eliminating barriers for our student veterans and our military students. Uh, those things include waiving the application fee. Uh, we give credit for military service. Uh, we also um, honor uh, and accommodate uh, their military obligations should they need to be um, to leave a campus for any reason during the semester. And we offer advanced registration for these students. They're able to actually register for classes um, two days prior to normal registration period. And we opened several years ago the Lieutenant Colonel Allen R. Baldwin Veteran Resource Center. Um, students are able to come and get assistance with their educational benefits. Uh, we do the advanced registration there. Um, it's a USO type lounge area where students can come and relax, decompress, uh, come and have lunch uh, between classes. There are several couches, um, a couple of recliners and a flat screen TV so they can just relax and hang out. That allows the students an opportunity to have the camaraderie that they had when they were in the military and to be able to meet with other members, other veterans and share stories and just relax and, and enjoy each other socially. But one of the wonderful things that I found at Morehead State University is the culture of the people, the culture of the faculty, the staff, uh, the culture of the students and the community on how they support our military past and present. As a uh, veteran myself, 26 year veteran of the armed forces, uh, I really found the passion in this community that is sometimes lacking in other communities and uh, it comes out in the programs that, uh, that are offered to our students and it comes out in the attitude uh, that our community has towards our, our veterans. Uh, the transition process uh, I found was uh, very, very good. Um, when I transferred from uh, military life into uh, you know, the civilian classroom, I had the, the luxury of having a, a, my, my counselor introduced me to um, my advisor over here who is uh, Mr. Joey Bryant and he's helped me 100% uh, th through everything uh, just a really great guy um, really helped helped me as far as you know making sure that my classes were straight uh, that uh, I'm staying you know on top of all of my all of my coursework so very very top-notch the privilege is very rewarding, um, being a, a disabled veteran myself, uh, going to school here and, and you know, trying to get you know, used to being back in the civilian life, you know, it was extremely difficult. And I see a lot of myself in the new, the new students that, you know, that come on campus and experience the same issues. And it's very rewarding to help those that, you know, that need assistance with transitioning from, you know, from the military life back to civilian, uh, it's a great privilege. I think it's a great thing how MSU shows their support for veterans. Well, I was really impressed as a 50-year-old student to come back to school with uh, kids my son's age. Uh, but it's amazing the support that I've received from all of the faculty, the, the professors. Uh, it's just been a warm atmosphere uh, to give me the opportunity. It's just been the best opportunity that I've ever been presented. I think if you're wanting to come back to college uh, at any age, regardless of how old you are, uh, if you want to do it, you can succeed. You should not let anything stand in the way of your success. Faculty and staff, they, they are, are very, very uh, good at making sure the veterans are taken care of here. Uh, assisting them with any problems they ha may have, whether it's struggling with their homework, you know, new social settings, or you know, old familiar settings, you know, with the VFW or, or the American Legion. Um, so really, it's the whole campus working together to make sure the veterans are getting, you know, what they need to make a, tr a, a smooth transition from the military life to civilian life. It, it's really great to see what Morehead State University does for our servicemen and women. Uh, our, our veterans are welcomed with open arms here at the university and uh, they really find a, a sense of home here and also they find a sense that people really do value what they've done for our nation and so it's, it's, it's 
always a, a, a pleasure to come in to this culture and help navigate or help students navigate uh, uh, the university culture in order to achieve their educational goals when you have a community of professors and fa uh, faculty, staff, administration that truly want them here and want them to maximize uh, their education potential.